Welcome to Oswego's Now Weekend Now. I'm Jolie Santiago and we're here to talk about the 61st annual juried show. Welcome Cece Scrano, graduate assistant at Tyler Hall's Art Gallery. Thank you so much for joining us Cece. Of course, I'm a pleasure to be here. Thank you and you know we have a lot to talk about so let's get right into it. Tell us what the 61st annual juried show is. So the 61st annual juried show really is a student art exhibition uh, by the students for the students, where any student of any art major or non-art major can submit their work into an official gallery space to show the world and hopefully future employers. Yeah, and this has it been going on for how long now? Well, uh, as the name entices, 61 years. <laughs> <laughs> and this started back in January, right, with this year's uh, showings of all the artists? Yeah, uh, it, technically the show started in January, but behind the scenes we started in early December just to collect the work itself. And what really is this process like? You start with the collection of this and then you go into the viewing process and now it's the last weekend already for people to watch, uh, to look and observe the art. What's this whole process like for behind the scenes? So the process for us was I'm also the president of the Student Art Exhibition Committee. Uh, and as president, we led the deciding points of how many artworks we're going to show, what sizes they're going to be. Uh, and we even chose the jurors ourselves, the people who voted on uh, the juror awards for those artworks to come in. Um, and they're actually alumni themselves. It was Christopher Moore and Lacey McKinney. Hmm. And there's two pieces in particular that you were able to show us today. So why don't you kind of talk about those two pieces for us? So the two pieces that me and my uh, club chose were, first it was Greg Hartman Souders, uh, August 2nd, 2022, and it's a beautiful large-scale watercolor painting, and it really is just, we, we chose it because it was a good uh, moment of memory, of just sitting on a hill watching the, it was either a sunrise or a sunset with a bunch of friends, with people playing, the birds are singing. And it was a really beautifully depicted moment, and me and my members definitely uh, appreciated a lot. And the second one we chose was uh, Miss Kaylee Roth's Beauty Balloons in Odd Places. And this one was particularly special to me because I absolutely loved the rendering of the painting. Uh, I loved the scale of it. It was this giant rectangle. Uh, and just the, the message it shows of how the most simple things of a, a boot with a flower in it to a little goldfish in a plastic baggie can be absolutely mesmerizing and, and beautiful. Well, thank you so much, Cece. We hope that the people watching now will go see this at the Tyler Hall Art Gallery. It is the last weekend, so definitely go and watch that or see that whenever you get the chance. Thank you so much, Cece. Of course, anytime. Have a great day.